myself are just staying outside of Church Stretton in the Shropshire Hills and it's somewhere that's been nicknamed Little Switzerland. We've downloaded a circular walk guide called the Burway Loop from the National Trust um, website which should take us through Carding Mill Valley and to the peak of Long Mint. It's about five miles or eight kilometres and it's supposed to take approximately two and a half hours but that doesn't take into account me stopping every five minutes to take a photograph. So we'll see how we get on. So here's the car park at Carding Mill Valley. Members can park for free. There's quite a lot of parking. I believe there's an overflow car park as well. So we're going to set up from here into this amazing valley. And already we've seen some lambs and some sheep. This is common land, so the local farmers have commoner rights to graze their livestock here. Looks like it's going to be a good day, but it is starting to cloud over a bit. mistake that we made of parking in the first car park there's actually two car parks so go up to the second car park if you can okay this is the chalet pavilion this is our start point tea room cafe toilets there's no barbecues, no campfires, no drones, and no camping allowed here. But yeah, looking good so far. ponies graze the land up here they selectively graze and they leave this vegetation um, which has made a really good um, like a habitat for lots of different insects lots of different birds um, and for this reason long mint common which is where we are right now has been designated as a site of special scientific interest so it's, you know, it's pretty much protected land. Um, yeah, look at that. It's gorgeous up here. We can see it for miles. But we're nearly at the trig point. We're nearly at the highest point. So let's crack on.
before we knew it, we were back at the same point that we had started from. So, what did you think of the bow on loop yesterday? It was hard. <laughs> what part of it was hard? The steep bits. <laughs> The first climb. The first climb was awful. <laughs> I mean, it was just, it keeps stopping. Yeah. But when you get to the top, yeah. it's all right, and it flattens out a bit. Yeah. And then coming down the other side, it was good, but it, it's tough to get up there. Yeah. Yeah, so it's, yeah. And it's cold up top, isn't it? Cold, windy. It was bitterly cold you need at the top. This time of year, what time of year is it? It's April, it's e- well, it's Easter. Yeah, yeah. April. So, yeah, it was bitterly cold at the top. Yeah, saw lots of people, lots of runners. Mountain bikers. Mountain bikers, people with dogs. So it's popular. It's but it just, it is, yeah. You need to um, dress up and put on your hiking boots. Yeah, because it, it's very steep. The first climb that we took, um, we went up by, I think it's called Cow Ridge, up that way. Very steep, the path there. Coming back down, not so bad. Coming yeah, back, coming back was easy. The, you know, other, the other path round. Very scenic there, very scenic. Like some wonderful views, lots of sheep. Yep. Lamb, horses. Ponies. Ponies were nice. Yeah, it was good, wasn't it? Yeah, good. What are we doing today? No idea. <laughs> we don't know what Absolutely we're doing today. Absolutely no idea what we're doing. So watch we're, this space. Yeah, watch this space. We'll make it up as we go along. Yep. Yep. <laughs> so where are we? We've come to Shrewsbury. Or is it Shrewsbury? If you know which one it is, please tell us in the comments because we don't know if it's Shrewsbury or Shrewsbury. I think it's Shrewsbury. I think it might be Shrewsbury. Um, yeah, so we're in Shrewsbury today, having a look around, seeing what we can find. It was early when we arrived, so the first thing to do was get some breakfast so we had the strength to explore. There was no plan and we had no route in mind going to wander along the alleys and roads until we found something interesting to look at. we visited on a Monday and sadly lots of the places of interest are closed then. Probably our favourite find was this little graveyard. It was a gorgeous little sun trap and locals come here to eat their lunch. We rested here for a while enjoying the good weather and the spring flowers before moving on to look at the rest of the town centre.
What's that building? What up there? No, what's that building behind I you? I don't know. I've got no idea. <laughs> don't you know where you are? Uh, um, Shrewsbury. Yes. Well, I don't know what the building is called. That behind you is Shrewsbury Castle. Is it? It is. And it's also home to the Shropshire Regiment Museum. If you haven't been in to have a look yet. <laughs> we haven't seen it. We just We just know that that's taken, what it is. Taking someone else's word for it. So the first castle on this site was 1067. Seven. Well done, I remembered. Yep. But when was this site restored? Because it fell into disrepair 16, in the 1300s. 1643, so about quarter five. <laughs> Next time we fall out over a scone and I forget something really obvious. Nothing? <laughs> I didn't forget anything. <laughs>